Our son was a cutter, started about the age of 12, um, used to cut severely. The pain that he inflicted on our family was severe, not just on his personal life, but also on all the people that were around him. Baker acted several times. He was hospitalized several times, would always, towards the end, try to commit suicide, um, jump in front of running cars, jump out of our car. It was a nightmare to live with, constant fear of him taking his life. And he really wanted to, begging to let him take his life because he didn't want to live in his head anymore. We chose Wellington Retreat. Um, it was recommended uh, by us with some mutual friends that are in the medical field. And what this particular doctor had said is that he, she didn't know what Dr. Moran did or what they did here. However, she called it a miracle place or miracle worker is what she refers to uh, when talking about Dr. Moran. Because what she said is that she has seen patients come in that she couldn't believe that they were here and that he had the hope to, to help them. And then in a month or two, she would see them again and could not believe the difference. It was like a totally different person. That was part of it. The other part is when we called, at this time we were desperate. Our son was in, um, was hospitalized and, and then we had to find a place for him because we just couldn't take him home the way he was and start all over again. So when I called here, the best thing that happened was they immediately asked us, oh, do you want to come over right now? And trying to figure out, okay, is this the right place? I already had a medical uh, doctor that had referred this place to us. But then the ability to just come in and sit and talk to the uh, individuals, I believe it was a director at that time, and then to actually go in and talk to some of the kids, not about what was wrong with them, but just to see the interaction and the whole community um, philosophy, it was just amazing. And I felt comfortable because there was no, no preparation, no hidden agenda, they were open, they told us what it was, and they made it up front very clear that the family needed to be involved, which we loved. Because in the other facilities, we felt that our child was getting treatment, but we were outside. So we really didn't know how to even work with him when he came home. So that really made it, made the deal. Our son has been, this is the third treatment center that he's been in. He was in the first treatment center at 12, the second one at 16, and that was a short uh, lift one. He was Baker acted from that facility, and after that he came here. How Wellington Retreat has helped our son is, we brought a broken child in, someone that was suicidal, was tired of living at the age of 16. When we picked him up a few months later, it was like a, picking up a totally different child, but he also came to a totally different family and a home because we had learned alongside of him. I guess we have our child back. The little boy that we once had, he came back. He came back to us. It's been a year now and it's been a blessing. It's really a miracle. I would recommend Wellington Retreat to anyone who has any issues with a loved one. I have seen this place help not just our child, but adults. It really is a miracle working place. It's incredible if you follow the, the program and the recommendations of the treatment team. Um, it really is, has been a godsend to our family. And oft, I've volunteered myself anytime that there's parents that wanna come in because it's a different perspective from a parent perspective than from a medical individual. Um, I just love what they have done with people, not just our child, but everyone, but recommended absolutely 1,000%.